Gone with the games. When I say that to you, what do you think of? That's right, the Falcons. That's one thing. Even though we haven't had the Olympic Games in Atlanta for a long time, we still have games in Atlanta. Think about it. We've got the Falcons. You've just seen that. We've got the Braves in baseball. Atlanta Hawks at Phillips Arena in basketball. You know this. But we've got basketball and pickup on streets. We've even got the swimming. We've even got hacky sack here and there. We've got a lot of games. We even have relationship games. That's right. Women playing games with men, men playing games with women, the bar scene. I go literally five nights a week to the tavern at Phipps. The online dating scene. We've got games all over the place in Atlanta. What do you mean gone with the games? All you have to do is play to play a game is be single. Uh, I take that back. I take that back. There are some people who can even play games and they're not single. Did you realize the South has the highest divorce rate of all regions in the country? Think about that. Why do you think that? Games. The games. Now, I'm not complaining, okay? I'm not complaining, personally. My personal life is out of this. I haven't been married yet. I'm on a good path. I'm not going to go there. But I've seen a lot, and I've seen a lot of games played out there. And my point is that, folks, the one greatest sport in Atlanta is the sport of relationships. That's right. It's not football. No. It's not baseball. No. It's not basketball. Not at all. It's not field hockey. No. It's not even roller derby. No. It's the game of relationships. The only thing gone with that game is your sanity. It will drive you nuts. So gone with the games? Nah. Not really. Think about it.